warning tonight about a potential health threat to your family this summer. That threat is no bigger than the size of a thumbtack, but state health officials say it can do some serious harm. 24 Hour News 8's Dustin Grove is here with more on ticks, Lyme disease, and one local woman's two year struggle to recover. Debbie, doctors say this is a disease so many people just don't think about, and so we often don't take precautions to avoid it. A Greenfield woman wishes she had. This is my rock garden. Pam Campbell loves her backyard gardens and the beauty of the outdoors. I see God's work at hand. But two years ago, she says something out here is likely what made her so sick. I think just walking through the grasses or through the, the shrubs back there that I must have picked up a tick. Swollen joints, pain, and severe exhaustion plagued her for months. After several doctors and tests, the diagnosis, Lyme disease, a bacterial illness that spreads from the bite of a deer tick. She was on her first round of antibiotics for half a year. When I started feeling better, I said, let's just go off all that stuff, I'm done. And within three months, I was so sick and so weak. It was awful. Then came round two. They said one to two years, hopefully you'll feel better. Doctors say diagnosing it can be tricky. The symptoms of Lyme disease mimic many things, including the common viruses you see out there. So doctors say the best way to avoid getting sick is to prevent being bitten at all. If you're going to be outside, especially in a wooded area, wear long sleeves and insect repellent with DEET. And because ticks are so small, smaller than the tip of your finger, make sure and check your whole body once you leave. Especially kids. Um, the kids and the elderly are more susceptible to the disease. Health experts say you likely have 24 hours to find the tick before you're infected. So frequent tick checks can really help prevent getting the disease. Two years later, Pam Campbell is improving, but still fighting to fully recover. If one good thing could come out of this, it'd be that somebody would know to check for ticks, because I didn't know. Symptoms of Lyme disease include a circular bullseye type rash around the bite, plus joint pain or weakness of the facial muscles. Early treatment is best. That lessens the chance of long term health problems. But Daniel and Debbie, not everyone gets that telltale bullseye rash. Blood work is what's required, and that doesn't come back for several weeks. That's why it's so important just to check for ticks once you're out of the woods or out of the yard to do that in the first place. I would imagine it'd be important to check your animals as well. Absolutely. Doctors said it. That's why it's so important to check for ticks with your pets too. All right. All right. Dustin, thank you. Yep.